What is up guys, it is your boy Killer Expert back with another video. Today I'm going to be talking about the 5.41 patch notes. Bear with me guys, I'm a little bit sick so that's why my voice sounds a little bit off. But without further ado, let's get right into the video. Before we do that though, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate all the support. I recently got to 1k watch time. I really appreciate everybody that is supporting the channel and liking the videos. I cannot thank you enough. So, the 5.41 patch was centered around the release of the new legendary Port of Fortress, which is basically just a huge port of fort. As you guys are seeing right now on the screen, it is actually humongous. Um, I guess it would have to be to justify carrying it in the final 10. Um, I'm not sure if I would do that, but I guess um, they're making it like this, so hopefully people do. The next biggest thing that was a huge surprise to everybody was the new Spiky Stadium. So this is basically like a new mini game in uh, the Playground LTM. Um, it is a limited time item or mini game. I'm not sure how long that's going to last. I feel like they should just leave it in there. But as you guys can see on the screen, you have to go to a red balloon, not a um, yellow balloon supply drop to get this. Um, it's basically like a grenade. And so when you throw the grenade, you are creating a stadium with a bunch of bounce pads and spikes. I'm not sure how many people will actually play this. Um, I think it would be something pretty cool to play with for a few minutes, but um, I'm not really interested in it. But I know a lot of people that just love to play play around in playground mode and do stuff like this. So hopefully that fits this that audience. So along with these big um, item releases, the patch 5.41 also came with a lot of bug fixes. So um, this isn't really a bug fix, but it's something that console players have been longing for for a long time. They have reduced the timing it takes to edit. So um, your editing button is going to now take 0.15 seconds on Builder Pro instead of 0.25 seconds. And on every other layout, if you guys still play on old school, Combat Pro, or Quick Builder, you're going to be reduced by 0.5 seconds from 0.25 or 0.25 seconds to 0.2 seconds. So this is a huge improvement, and I'm very glad that they did this. Um, I still think that they need to implement the tap to edit, um, just like it is on PC, so that console players can actually be competitive. Even though we've seen competitive, you know, uh, console players but just so that we can have the leg up that the PS or the PC has. And so the last few changes of this update were or include the um, the pullback of the storm destroying builds that were in the storm in the final stages um, of the circle. Um, this is no longer in the game. It came out in the, the high stakes event um, patch but I guess Epic didn't like it. Um, it hasn't really affected me. I've just been cautious about that. So I've never died to storm damage or, or fall damage through the storm. But um, yeah, that's fixed. And uh, something that was small but is great is that they fixed the, um, the time between the minis. Um, I hope made a whole video about that saying that they sec secretly patched this item. Um, I guess it was just a mistake and so they reverted it back to where you can drink minis one after another super fast. Um, this is what I thought made it a viable option or healing um, item. So I'm glad they put that back in the game. And the last thing is that they made it, um, they made players aware of where there's a bounce pad on the opposite side of a wall. So if you're looking at a wall, as you can see on screen, there's gonna be a blue um, glowing light that is shown um, to you that lets players know that there's a bounce pad on the opposite side of the wall. So, um, you know, that's just an addition. Not sure why they added that, but I guess it can be nothing but helpful, right? So that is it for today's video, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed the content. Sorry, this is a little bit late. Um, it's not my usual 6 a.m. upload on update days, but hopefully you can get this information and hop right into a Fortnite game. So. With all that being said, have a great day, guys. Go.